Ebana mambo vipi 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 Ishe Gomaria na hii ni A Digital na please kama bado ya subscribe hakikisha kwamba una subscribe ili uweze kupata zile habari zote na exclusives ambazo tunazifanya every single day kupitia A Digital lakini pia na AFM Radio 92.9 Dodoma e, mkazi wa Singida mkazi wa Morogoro na mikoa ya karibu of course mnakuwa mnatusikiliza kwa undani zaidi and now it is your time kwa wewe ku subscribe ili uweze kupata zile habari zote. Sasa one of the video vixen lakini pia mrembo na msomi na sasa hivi of course naweza nikamsema ni msanii wa Bongo Flavor kutoka nchini Tanzania. Anaifahamika kama Madeline lakini yeye anajiita The Tanzanian Lioness. Uh, ambaye pia ni amefanya um, vixen ambapo ametokea kwenye video mbalimbali za wasanii mbalimbali wakubwa ikiwemo Ali Kiber Demo Platinums, Ibra. Of course this time bana toka jana stories zimesambaa sana kwenye social medias baada ya yeye kusema kwamba alimfata Ali Kiber kwenda ku He, aweze kumshauri kwenye mziki wake atafanya vipi atafanya hivi na hivi na hivi lakini at the end of the day walijikuta wameanzisha relationship na wakawa wana date and baada ya hapo of course alikuweza uh, kufani hakuweza uh, kutimiziwa yale ambayo alikuwa anayataka kutoka kwa Ali Kibar alimshauri ali, I mean, ali, ali alikuwa akiamini kwamba kuwa na Ali Kiba angeweza kutoka katika safari yake maybe ya music kwa sababu alingia kwenye Vixen akiwa anapenda sana masuala ya kuja kufanya music and this time bana amefunguka amechafua sana hali ya hewa huko kwenye social media zinasemekana kwamba eh, wawili hawa sasa hivi wapo kwenye ugomvi mkubwa sana and it is true wapo kwenye ugomvi mkubwa of course um, nitakuwa na Madeline hapa na ataweza kutuambia what is going on baada ya yeye jana kumsema alikiba je amemtafuta lakini pia tunaona kwenye social media zake i mean kwenye Instagram page yake ameweza kushare baadhi ya pictures na videos ambazo zikimuonyesha kwamba alikuwa yupo na Ali Kiba lakini pia kati ya messages ambazo pia ameshare ni messages ambazo pia alikuwa kichati na Ali Kiba kuna moja hapa ameweza kushare like Ali Kiba anamuuliza who is this guy and uh, wow you see uh, Ali Kiba kaja kumwambia I'll make you happy when I come back please don't cheat on me lakini pia akamwambia I love you so much sweetheart if you don't know and uh, ni maneno ambayo alikiba alikuwa akimwambia lakini pia alijaribu kushare the video ambayo alikuwa yupo na alikiba ndani ya gari wakienjoy the song ya alikiba akaandika I'm still lying ni swali ambalo wameuliza watu watu wengi wanafikiri kwamba the girl anatafuta kiki na ili aweze kutoka lakini pia nikasema lazima nipige story na Madeline tuweze kujua je yeah, it is true Madeline how is you darling how how, how you doing hey I'm doing better. I'm glad niliweza kushusha kitu ambacho in the bigger picture itawasaidia watu especially wanawake in this industry. Okay sweetheart. Kuna hichi ambacho kinaendelea sana kwenye social media toka jana my darling umeteka sana uh, vicho vya habari huko. Unafikiri uh, watu wengi wanasema kwamba ni kiki. Hebu tuweke wazi kwenye hili. Je, ni kiki kweli ama ni kweli ulikuwa uh, una date na Alikiba? Uh, yeah, let them talk but my message still stays the same. Okay na pengine this time alikiba amekutafuta maybe ili muweze kuongea yaishe No sijaongea na Ali in months na sina mpango wa kuongea naye ever again in my life His chawas on the other hand though are attacking me <laughs> The chawas are really chowering right now Okay. Kwani kuna tua, uh, kuna tua yoyote ambayo umeamua kuchukua baada ya hili? Tunajua kwamba umesema kwamba mlikuwa mna date, mmeachana na kuna vingi ambavyo ulitamani alikiba afanye kufanya. Kuna tua yoyote ambayo utachukua sasa from now on. Um, I'm still in therapy. I'm still kwenye my healing journey. But I'm glad nimeweza kuwaonyesha you know uwezo wangu kwa kuanzia by releasing my song Penzi Jipya na kuonyesha my talent 
despite him saying kwamba i would never be able to do so na jay kitokea sasa eh, akakutisha what will you do utaenda wapi una utafanya nini mbona alishafanya hivyo he's already threatened my safety na ku expose my pictures amongst other things i mean we both said some really terrible things to each other at the end of the day i only fear god because god is more powerful than any man na najua mungu yupo pande wangu you guys can follow me on instagram on facebook on youtube madeline tz na wapenda sana and take care bye Okay guys that is Madeline ama the Tanzanian lioness mmetoka kumsikiliza and this time anatamba na wimbo wake unaokwenda kwa jina la Penzi Jipia sasa Penzi Jipia ndio hiyo ambayo ulitoka kwa Diamond Platinumz ukaamua kuingia kwenye Penzi Jipia na ito Maria Alphonse thank you guys for your time and let me see you next time we love you and make sure kwamba unakuwa tofauti see you bye bye